This is New Albion on Mars. Almost all organic material inside New Albion arrived here from Earth. New Albion's viability depends on keeping that material active in a closed cycle. For that reason, there are neither rubbish dumps nor graveyards on New Albion. Everything is recycled. Some recycling at New Albion is similar to that on Earth. For example, water is recovered from drains and converted back into potable water. Some recycling circles are larger than others. We convert some wastewater back into potable water directly, as Singapore on Earth does with new water. Most of our wastewater, as for most of Earth, is currently directed through natural compartments where plant and animal life act on the water as a first stage of treatment. Solid organic waste is likewise directed as much as possible through natural cycles as feeds, composts and fertilisers, which produce food, textiles and some construction material for the colony. The colony possesses small circle organic waste recycling equipment, which can reduce the time and space needed to convert solid organic waste to solid nourishment. The equipment is used mainly for research, its perfectly nutritious products being unpopular with colonists, even as emergency rations. Inorganic waste or no longer wanted items are collected and taken to dedicated recycling areas, known collectively to colonists as New Haven. Reusable items or parts are offered for free to colonists who can find a use for them. Inorganic waste that's difficult to reuse or recycle is subjected to more complex treatments to recover any useful material and the remainder rendered safe and combined with a compost stream. Colonists are themselves part of the circle of life at New Albion. There are no graves to mark end of life at New Albion. Our closed cycle means past colonists are always with us. At New Albion we say, all roads lead to New Haven.